We're styling no one. We're styling no one. This is Neva styling me. Hi, I'm Noen Eubanks, and I'm from Atlanta, Georgia. Noen is a TikTok superstar. You've seen him on Instagram, but now he's here on Neva. The Neva girls have one day. We all have to share him and give him three brand new looks. They're about to be fire. Make sure that you guys subscribe, hit that notification bell. It was a big thumbs up! And leave a comment down below in the first three hours to win a pair of Hyra socks. Stay tuned to the end of the episode for a very special giveaway. No one likes to do his colored hair. His style is very soft goth. Goth boy, e-boy aesthetic. Sometimes he does bright colors, but a lot of times he likes to wear black. I don't know. The girls like it. The girls seem to love it. Today, we're going to be putting no one in tons of different looks, taking him out of his comfort zone. Hey, you guys. I'm sorry I couldn't be in this episode. I'm sure the girls are going to do an amazing job. And no one, I hope you have fun. <laughs> One of my favorite movies is Romeo and Juliet by Baz Luhrmann. The movie is super iconic because of its aesthetic. What fools, you know not what you do! And because Leonardo DiCaprio was young Leo in it and he looked super fire. We're gonna be turning no one into Leonardo DiCaprio. The inspiration for my look is I'm gonna go like a little peep. I love little peep. He is actually like a really big inspiration to me of like just being weird, expressing yourself and not caring what anyone thinks. I'm gonna take the two, mix it all together and come out with no one. <laughs> with no one. <Yeah. laughs> hey. So no one is here. What's up? We're just gonna zhuzh you up, boy. Zhuzh me up. Zhuzh, zhuzh. What is that? Zhuzh. Gotcha. So back home, where did you usually get your clothes from? Did you thrift or yeah, like? everything. I thrift everything I own. Yeah, same. Literally everything. We're in Brick Lane, we're gonna go thrifting. We are going to rock it, and it's loud as hell. Okay, but wait, Noan, tell me about your style. Um, my style, it actually is a hard question because I have no clue. I kinda just wear whatever I want to. I feel like a samurai. <laughs> a samurai? Are you open to like doing kind of like femme dressing a little? Clothes don't have a gender. Unless they're maternity, then it's kind of awkward. I'm open to whatever. Okay, Sorry. well, that's what we're literally gonna do. Cause like, we're just trying things this year, right? <laughs> no, okay, not lingerie. What about shoes? Do you have any shoes you don't like? No, I don't wear shoes. I am here at Revolutionary Go-Kart to go go-karting with no. This is the perfect environment to set it all up and get really in the, the zone. I have a feeling it's gonna be something race themed. Maybe like a onesie, maybe like a racing onesie. Onesie, is that what you call it? That's what a baby wears. It's they gave cool. us these like hair baklavas. Balaklava. Balaklava. Do I look cool? I don't trust you. Do I look cool? <laughs> You're like a doctor. <laughs> and then we got these gloves. And the gloves, they smell like bananas. They kind of smell like bananas. This is so banana, it's like laundry detergent. Maybe your banana smells like laundry detergent. Maybe your laundry detergent smells like banana. No one, today I'm gonna turn you into a bad boy. Mood. Mood, yeah. Good. So, me and Noan went to End. Let's find some cute outfits for you. What did you think of End? Ooh, that's cute. It's like ugly carpet. Um, it was nice, actually. I really like that. I'm gonna have to go back there. What do you think of this color? Um, yeah, it's brown. <laughs> so we just left Rocket because it was too damn loud in there. Hearing? What's that? There wasn't anything that I could like even mix into like the no, little peep style. Nice. So at Attica, we're gonna find some trousers. 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 Okay. There's stairs. I like stairs. I don't. I'm just gonna try to find more goth pieces, more black pieces, just like. Jackets on jackets. Okay. Is anyone in there? Yeah, me. <laughs> this is kind of like the shirt that he wore in Romeo and Juliet. And it goes with your hair. Oh yeah, I guess yeah, this part goes with my hair. I think you need a toothbrush. Yeah. 
It matches the hair. Anything goes as long as it matches. So me and Non were trying to film, but then they caught us. Yeah. Okay, all right, thank you. This lady immediately like darted over to us and was like, no filming, because I think she saw us like yeah. on the stairs, because you're loud. So I was putting punk fits together. Oh, in all black. Everything that I was finding was like women's wear, so everything didn't fit his body exactly right. Oh, okay. So it's a little small. She I saw a skirt. <laughs> I had to do it to him. You're gonna try on the skirt. You're gonna make me try this one. Yes. I had to give the people what they wanted. Show us. I stepped out of my comfort zone a little bit. <laughs> a lot of it. Oh wait, I was about to say you could change, but you're feeling it. <laughs> you're feeling it. Go on. I'm a little nervous just because I don't know how to drive. I don't have a license, I don't have a permit. I've never even gone in to take a driving test. Yeah, yeah, I have a license, so driving is really not that hard. I'm a very safe driver and I take like so much precaution. It was really fun, I really liked it. I was going so fast. Sometimes I was going so fast I thought I was gonna like freaking tip over. Well I know in the second race and when no one was beating me, I was trying to like catch up to him and I was right behind them and this other girl. Let's call her number 10. I don't know, I, I got on the track and I, I felt like I kind of switched and I got very aggressive. So it's like no one right here, number 10 right here, and it's like I was pretty mean, honestly. We are at my house. We got all my makeup brushes. This is actually made out of his hair. I'm gonna do a signature look on him, and maybe he's gonna do my makeup. Put Noan in the dressing room. I put him in Fear of God pants, a Fear of God top, and then a Montclair vest, and then these Margiela's. And that outfit was like my favorite, but it wasn't sticking the Romeo and Juliet. Yeah, it was not young Leo. <laughs> but it was nice. So this is foundation. Mm -hmm. I don't know if this is your color, but we'll Here see. We so then I found another shirt and it matched his hair and it was super cute. I found these cool like sweats, but suspender streetwear pants that yeah, I really, were really liked. That fit I really liked. I feel like it was more of like your vibe. I my feel like. vibe. So this is the face beating part. Mm -hmm. Where you actually beat your face. Are hey, you getting a little aggressive. <laughs> What's your favorite um, TikTok trend? Yeah. TikTok talk. Y'all be wilding on there. Not y'all, do not include me in a lot of <laughs> stuff that they do. Oh, my favorite is a Peppa. The third fit was very interesting. This looks so good. And our outfits go together. You're gonna have to close your eyes. I'm just excited because I know after he was out with Esme Angel, he's like, oh, this girl is annoying. He talks so much and it's so loud. And I'm the same way, but this is shopping. No, he twerk. No. This is go kart racing. And if that doesn't make him want to choose me, then he's got bad taste in that time period. Do one little. I don't know what this is. Oh, I love nose glow. Oh! If no one doesn't want to do something, he'll go. Absolutely not. Ew, is that black? <laughs> Ew! <laughs> what did you think I was going to do? <laughs> Stay tuned to the end of the episode for a very special giveaway. Oh. <laughs> I look like I need to shave. <laughs>the studio we are here with Noen. Hi, I'm Noen Eubanks. No, what race are you? Are you just white? Damn Angel, are what? you just white? Oh my god Karen, you can't just ask people why they're white. Do you know where you're from? Georgia. Georgia? Mm -hmm. Oh you're like southern? Do the accent. The southern no. male. He's a southern male. Southern a good male. boy. I love you. Let's talk about TikTok. How did that even start? Like did you just start making videos? The first one that I made was for my brother who was like it was awful, I still have it, and people keep on finding it. And I come back two months later, and it has 100 views. I lost it. I know about the one iconic video. What's the one that I threw on my Instagram. The, damn, the, the song. She's like, yeah. with diamonds in my pearls. Oh, wait, that one's that one. I was like, thank you, I designed it. So, 
Who do you want to see first? Uh, Faith. Okay, I've been working like three jobs. Probably why I never see ya. Probably why I never have time for the fake friends. I won't be ya. Oh God, I've been running now. Up early when the sun is out. Not setting out my own soul, but those real ones, they coming now. 23 in my prime, though. Finna ball like Lonzo. Go and tell everybody talking stage. Better be in that convo, uh. Yo. Ooh. I want to wear that. Ooh, tell me. What? <laughs> You know, like what you do to babies, like when you blow it. Oh, yeah. I swear. <laughs> when you blow your belly. Come. Absolutely not. So his fit is by London-based designer Alex Mullins, and this is just a Harley Davidson tee that I crop show a little tum tum. I like the Harley Davidson crop top that I was put in. It's not something that I wear regularly, but I kind of like it. If you guys think that we should bring back guys wearing crop tops, let us know in the comments. What do you guys think? I love this fit. <laughs> I love that she did a co-ord, like a two-piece set, because that's my favorite thing. And I feel like guys don't do it as often. I could see wearing this and I wouldn't think like, oh, this isn't his style or anything. Like, no, and you need to make a TikTok right now. I took the top off. <laughs> no one's looking at me like I'm crazy. Oh, yeah. This outfit is so clean. I love the little crop top. How do you feel in it? Yeah, how do you like this look? To be honest, I'm not a fan. Uh... Hello, darkness, my Sorry, Faith. Mm. Well, you look kind of like hot, so. The shoulders are, are kind of pointy. I felt kind of stiff. With the jacket on and without the jacket on, they felt like two completely different looks. Faith, thank you for the fit. Angel, let's go to yours. It, just bounce it. Everybody wanna come, I'm announcing it. I'm always gonna get it, I'm always gonna get it. Even if you sit back denouncing it. But I'm a good kid, I rock gold, I'm never gonna sleep with ya. I loved you, I've been wrong, but let me see the whole damn picture. But damn, I got it. Super when he popped it. Fake ass ride when he copped it. Roll the snowmobile so I know it's real. Nobody's ever really gonna stop it. Wait, is that my shirt? <laughs> it, bitch, is that my shirt? <laughs> Actually, it's Leonardo DiCaprio's shirt. She really went into my closet and acting like it was a whole ass shop. For no one's look, he has on some chains. Then he has these pants from Japanese streetwear brand, Mihara Yasuhiro. Oh, oh. I like the measurement oh, to the belt. Front. Wow. Yeah, yeah, that is really cute. And the shirt is from Esme, because I could have bought one, but why wouldn't I just take it from Esme, right? Ooh, right. she stealing. I, I want to steal something. I want to steal something. Esme, what are you doing? I love Romeo and Juliet, the one with Leonardo. The shirt was his shirt from the movie. I was really in love with it. I love how it matches my hair too, which is a pretty nice coincidence. I like the pants too. The rings as well, they're kind of mine. So like, of course I like them. These are my rings. This is my stuff. What do you guys think? Well, it's dead ass from my closet, so I like it. I love that she like took the opportunity to like make him a little dreamy young Leo. I knew you were just gonna like make him your personal snack. Um, <laughs> no one's like, I am not for sale. He's like, yeah. I am not a snack. <laughs> I <laughs> want a <laughs> meal. <laughs> I like what you did with his hair. I love the chains. I love the shirt. I think the pants are really cute, but I just don't like them with that top. For a young Leo look, it was mediocre. Good job, Angel. Thank you, Angel, but as made, your turn. Let's go. Popping on a west side, cause it's West Day. I just made a thousand, blew it in your face. I've been going in, uh, I'ma close the case. I can't wait no more, man, I got it blow today. Popping on a west side, cause it's West Day. I just made a thousand, blew it in your face. This is amazing. This is, this is cute. She literally resurrected Lil P. Uh, when he put on the outfit, I was like, oh my God, this is, is this what little people would be like? I love punk style so, so, so much. I think it's so cute. Punk style is not really like an aesthetic I ever really wear, but I live with you. So I gave him some face tats, kind of. They're like eyeliner, but it's also like a cross. I can't get this out of my head, but it reminds me of Coraline. The sweater's from Weekday. The pants are from Tiger of London. These are high top new rocks, and then 
The chain is from Feather Pendants. I like the necklace. It was like the clear, clear chain with a clear lock. I like this. You know I like this because first of all, he has the whole punk aesthetic that I love. It just literally is like me in a Caucasian male. Oh wait, so it really is. I, I love it. We I should have really love it. No, I'm just kidding. I, I loved Esme's look. It was so cute and something I probably would have put no one in. How do you feel? Good, I like it a lot, actually. I didn't think that I would. I like the pants a lot. Um, and I like the shoes, but I don't know how much longer I could wear them. They're very heavy. One word for Esme's look, spicy. People from where I'm from do not like this. Okay, you're not going back home. You're, 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 you're not ever going, no. Country boy, we stole you. <laughs> <laughs> Good job, Ez. Thanks. So thank you for styling me in all of your fits. I've been thinking about who the winner's gonna be, Angel. I really love this shirt. Oh, I, I love that shirt because I love that movie like so much. Faye, I really like the shirt without the jacket on and the shoes too, Esme. I did like the makeup, but with that you also, I don't know how I felt about the gems. I felt like that was a little bit much. I'm choosing this person's look in particular. Uh, because I felt like it was the closest to me. It's what I liked the most. There was a lot of personal elements in it and a lot of attention to detail. And the winner is... <laughs> Esme. <gasps> Yay! Yay! Little Peep is suddenly alive. <laughs> Make sure that you guys subscribe, hit that notification bell if you haven't already. Drop a comment and let me know how you would style me.